Hey guys, welcome to another Open Layers tutorial here. Um, so in the last two videos, we covered just some of the basics of using Open Layers and getting a web map up and running. Uh, in this video, what we're going to do is we're going to actually cover the way you're supposed to set up a project for distribution. Um, the way we've been doing it via the CDN or Content Delivery Network is not recommended for production, but it is a good way to test things out. And so we are gonna go through how we can set up an open layers project. Okay, so let's go ahead and we're just gonna keep working in this same project so you can see how things will change and we'll go from there and at the end we should still have a map that is working. All right, so let's get started here. The first thing I wanna do is you'll notice over here in my editor, I have this example folder. This is a folder and I can create a new file or a new folder in here. So I'm gonna create a new folder and I'm gonna call it libs and I'm going to create a new file, and I'm going to call it script.js, and I'm going to create another new file. Oh, I'm sorry, those are in the lib, so I want to move this out. Sorry, I want to move, sorry, cancel that. I want to move the script into example. If I can grab it and move it out here. Move, there we go. And I want to click on example, and I want to add a file there. And I want to call this one um, style.css. Okay, so here I have index, script, and style. And I just need to start moving some stuff around here now. Um, and I need to add some things to libs as well. Okay, so you notice I have this style here and I have dot map and it gives me a height and width. I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to just control X to cut it. I'm going to get rid of the style tags, come back over, and I'm going to go into my, my style.css, and I'm just going to paste dot map in there, and I'm going to save that. I'm going to save my index here. Okay. Now, the same thing with this script. I'm just going to come, and I'm going to cut this out, Control-X, and I'm going to come over to my script.js, and I'm going to paste that in, okay? And I'm going to control S, and I'm going to get rid of these uh, two script tags here, okay? And there we go. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and save that now. Okay, now we need to do a little more work here, and what we need to do um, is the style sheet we need to link it to style.cs or to, sorry, we need to download the style sheet and we need to download the script here. And so we're going to do that by going to open layers. So go over to the internet's openlayers.org. And what we want is we want to get the, uh, we want to download open layers. And so we can go to get the code. And we just want to make sure we get the right one here. So you notice this one includes, so this is the full build of the library uh, and a source map and the CSS, the OLCSS. This includes examples and API docs, the sources. We only need the distribution. So I'm just going to download this, click on that. And I'll just save it in my downloads folder. And then I'm going to show it in the folder. And I'm going to use 7-zip. You can also um, just use the built-in windows and extract all. I'm going to extract files. OK. And you see now I have this folder, v6.4.3-dist. And inside of that, there's another folder, and inside that I have four files. So I want to copy this folder with the four files. I'm just going to control C. And then I want to go to where I have my, um, I want to go to Visual Studio Code. I want to come into libs. And I want to see if I can just paste that in there. I'm going to just copy. And that didn't work, so we're going to have to go through to where I have it in my example code, open layers example. I'm going to go to libs and I'm going to paste. Oh, but it didn't copy. That's the problem. Let's go right click here 
and copy. Go back to my libs and paste it in there. So now I have my libs 6v6.4.3 dash dist. Okay, so we have that distribution and we're ready to go there. All right, let's head back over here now and we're going to need to update what we have here. Okay, and so I'm just going to get rid of this here and I'm going to hit dot slash lib slash and we have 6.4.3 and it was dist. You'll notice it's auto completing here so I can hit enter there and then we want to do um, ol.js and hit enter there. Okay, and I'm going to do the same thing for the style sheet. So I'm going to get rid of this. Out to here. We'll just get rid of that. And we'll do dot slash libs. That folder. And we want to do ol.css. Okay. And so that should give us our uh, CSS code. And our um, JavaScript for open layers. Okay, now we also need to link our C our style CSS over here. So we're going to come up and put this here. We're actually going to move some of this stuff around in just a minute. Um, we're going to do link, and we want to do whoops. We want to do rel equals style sheet. Um, we want to do href equals, and we're going to do again dot slash, um, and just go to style dot css, and we want to do type um, text css. All right, so that should get us set up there, and then we need to uh, close our link tag and oh sorry we don't need to close that we just need to close it like that okay so now we've got that that tag closed there now we just want to move our script down to link that in the body so we're going to link the scripts in the body and we're going to link the style sheets uh, up in the head. And so we'll just come right here and put that there. And now we need to also um, link our uh, the new script to create our script.js. Okay, perfect. And we're all set, linked up there. Okay. All right, so let's see if this is actually going to work for us or not. So let's go ahead and save this, make sure that's saved. And when I open index.html, it should give us our web map still. Um, but I've done something incorrectly, so let's just figure out what that is and get it fixed. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to go back to our JavaScript, and we need to make a function that gets called when the page loads, and then our map will, will get called then, okay? So let's come over here, and we have this set up. We just need to get a function here to run this. So let's go uh, function, and we'll call it init. And let's open that up and delete the closing curly brace and come down and put that curly brace down there. Okay. And then I'm just going to take and move all that over. And hopefully that sets things up for us like we want it to. So that should give us a function, our initialization or init function. And then what I want to do is in the script, I just want to call window.onload. And we're just going to assign init to it so that it runs on load. We're going to save that and let's go and see if this works. Go over to example, I'll open up my index.html and there you can see that our map is loaded with uh, all our functionality and our layers on there. 
Okay, so that's how you can set up an open layers project uh, the way you're supposed to for production. All right, guys, thanks for watching this video. Um, I'm hoping I can get these examples up on the open source options website. You'll know they're up on the website when there's a link to the code in the description of this video. Um, so once again, thanks for watching. We'll continue working with open layers um, so you can get some more ideas and, and learn more about how to create web maps.